Hello again everyone, it's Matt from Mark Roberts Motion Control. In this Flare 7 tutorial, I will show you how to export a move created in Flare to a variety of formats. The exported file can then be imported into other software packages. The move export window allows you to specify what format and additional data the exported file should contain. I won't go into detail with all of the options available to you, so if you would like more information, please have a read of the user manual or contact us with any questions. With an existing job open, specify the file you wish to create. For text-based files, you have the option to append the move data to an existing file. Select the data format you wish to export to. Cartesians will export the camera and target positions, plus the roll angle. 3Node will do the same thing, except that the up vector position is exported instead of the roll angle. Eulers will include the camera position, plus the pan, tilt and roll angles. Axes will export the raw axes positions, which is useful if you would like to model the rig yourself, or to interface with things like encoders on cranes or dollies. The coordinate system of the exported positions can be changed if you are importing into a CGI package with a different system, for example Maya or 3ds Max. The job name, lens name, aperture and field of view are all additional fields which can be added to the exported file. If you would like to export the waypoint positions only instead of each frame, check the waypoints only box. Once you're done, click the export button to begin the process. Additional axes can also be added to the export, and these are defined in the Additional Data section. For example, if I want to export the position of a model mover, I select it from one of the drop-down boxes. Exporting to an FBX file is also supported. The FBX 1, 2 and 3 node formats will create an FBX file with positions for either the camera, camera and target, or camera, target and up point respectively. Selecting an FBX format will ignore all other formatting options to adhere to the FBX file standard. The generated FBX file can then be imported into a CGI package and visualized there. Transformations can be applied during the export and these are enabled by checking Use Transforms. For example, if I want to rotate the move by 90 degrees around the origin, I enter 90 in the Rotate field. That brings us to the end of this tutorial. 